Hello, hello. Welcome to Shady and Why. I am having a end of year clearance sale. Between now and the end of the year, I might be doing quite a bit of this. Uh, just trying to bring you some good deals and um, clear out um, some room to, of course, make room for some new. And um, my favorite part of reselling is, of course, the thrifting. <laughs> I think that's all of our problem is like just getting that thrifting down. I've got that down. Hope everybody's doing great. If you haven't been here before, my name's Marilyn. My husband's name's Barry and we are resellers. We sell on multiple platforms and before we take it to our online platforms, we show it to you. We get, offer it to you at a cheaper um, rate than what we are going to put them online for and I give you the prices, and if you're interested in something at that price, you send us an email to one shadyandy at gmail.com in your invoice. If you haven't purchased from us before, simply send us your um, full name, mailing address. Be sure to send us a timestamp, and this is anybody, <laughs> send us a timestamp and a, a description. And I really, really, really need those timestamps. Um, I'm going through a lot of jewelry, and it's uh, hard to organize. So it's best if you give me, if it's not that day, at least give me the date or the name of the video and the timestamp that will really help me get back with you quicker. If you have any questions, definitely, um, leave them in the comments. Also, I do not take requests for any cells in the comments. You have to send us that email and, uh, we appreciate each and every one of you. So let's just go ahead. First off, we're going to start out with these Chico um, earrings. They were originally $19.95. These are brand new, new conditions, still on the card. Great for um, this time of year, especially for gifts. Um, something like this is really great to put in um, a little bag and put by the door and if somebody comes, you're not expecting them for the holidays, and you can pull out, uh, I have um, a basket, and it's like half men, half women, and then there's home items in the center, and this way you're just never not prepared. And um, I also have kids stuff. Uh, I just hate that feeling of somebody coming and not just welcoming them with a gift, but these are going to be just $5, and they're really nice and weighted, not missing any rhinestones. Now, this is, let's see where, yeah, right here. It says Mexico, and, man, this one is oxidized. It says Mexico. I know it's sterling. It is gorgeous. So I'm going to say let's do just $7 on the thimble. Here we have um, some cute little stud earrings. There is four of them. One, two, three, four pairs. And I'm just going to do $5 on the little studs. These are sterling silver. Um, nothing written on the back. Um, no backs on them. So I'll put silicone studs. Um, they're really nice and modernistic. So I'm just going to say, let's do $10 for those. And they are sterling. There's another pair of sterling. They are not marked and everything has been tested. Um, so these are sterling. Aren't those great? And I'm going to do $10 on those. Now this is a nice little set right here. This is, um, I have the earrings on here. Let me pull them off. They are for pierced ears. I just have them on here to keep them together. It is a, a leather, blue leather braided band. And it's a nice little set. So you've got nice size lobster clasp, the leather band, and then here, that is really pretty. And then the earrings, as I said, are pierced and they're little teardrops and on the set I'm gonna say just $15 
There you go. And they're all matching. Here we have a pair of sterling hoops. Let's get you a measurement. Two inches. So I'm just gonna say, let's do $12. It's a good price for sterling. These are also sterling and they're $12. And these are nice and oval shape. The largest is one and five eighths of an inch. And then the drop is two and three fourths. I forgot to say about my rings as usual. <laughs> this is a Danbury mint. It is cubic zirconia with a chocolate or mocha um, cubic zirconia swirl. Isn't that pretty? Um, these are a mocha color, just really nice. And this is a size. And it is signed 925 and with a Danbury Mint um, logo. This is a size 8 and 3 fourths. And just a really nice, well-crafted ring. And on this one, I'm going to say let's do um, $20. And then I have this one, which I have had for a long time. Uh, this is probably from the 1930s, 1920s, 1930s. Beautiful roses, gorgeous malachite. Uh, the malachite does have quite a bit of inclusions in it um, or cracks or whatever you want to call them, but they're not loose and whatever. There's no movement. Uh, the front of it is a repoussé of the roses and then the back. Isn't that pretty amazing? It's like the back of the roses. So there's the front and there's the back. This one is, I like I said, I've had this for a long time. Uh, this is a size 10 and 3 fourths. And on this one, I'm gonna do um, Uh, $45 today and this one is sweet this is um, such a nice little sterling ring lots of gorgeous detail it is adjustable on the back it is signed 925 Thailand and it is only a size two and three fourths I'm gonna say it's probably more of a yeah it's just it's a size three. And like I said, it is adjustable. Um, but I think it's a perfect midi ring. Um, so that's the rings today. Now here we have a um, Nemo piece. Nemo was a great um, company uh, back in the 40s and 50s. They weren't in, not in business very long. They generally did um, animals. And this is a mouse with big blue eyes, rhinestones. There's the back, it's just a little pen. It's a C-class pen. And this one is tiny. It is one inch by one inch. And on the Nemo, um, I'm going to do $8. Here we have a turtle in um, gold tone with rhinestones and I think it's green eyes. Um, it is signed. It's a craft. Uh, no missing rhinestones on the feet um, or the face. And I'm going to say let's do $8 for the turtle. Here we have a butterfly and it is a Sarah Coventry silver tone with um multiple textures to it and i'm just going to say six dollars for the sarah coventry here we have a pendant um it is not sterling silver it is just a uh, silver tone with color blocking of green and blue and uh, lavender color there's the back and on this i'm just going to say five dollars 
We have this peacock um, brooch. Uh, there's the back, no signature. Rhinestones, gold tone. And on this, I'm just gonna say $5. Uh, we have this little adjustable Caroline ring with flowers and rhinestones, so sweet. Right now it is set at a seven and a half. So on this one, let's just say, uh, that is sweet. I'm gonna say let's do just $8 on that. We have these Sarah Coventry clip-on earrings. They're signed Sarah Coventry. Um, they are glass, um, little stones, painted stones. And on these, I'm gonna say, let's just do $5. We have this little donkey, um, rhinestone, uh, gold tone brooch, unsigned, red eye, and I'm gonna do $6 on the donkey. We have Coldwater Creek earrings, um, still on the card. They were originally $29.95. And on these, I'm just gonna do, these. this part is wood, and then it has um, some beads. And on this, I'm gonna say, let's do, this is twisted, but it does fall down like this. So I'm just gonna say, let's do $5 on the Coldwater Creek. Here's another pair of sterling silver earrings. These are small little thick hoops and they swoop down. They are half an inch. And on these, I'm gonna say, let's do $10. Here is an um, Alex and Ani bracelet. It is signed 925. It is in gold tone. It is two little hearts and a cuff. This size. The size on this right now is sitting at about a seven and a quarter inch. And on this one, I'm gonna say $10 because it is sterling silver. Here we have this rhinestone bracelet. It says made in China, but I don't see any other marks on it. It is a fold over clasp and it is a rose gold um, color. And on this, I'm just gonna say $5. Now these are pretty, these are rose gold. Um, however, they are 925 by the company FAS, F-A-S. And uh, they are textured, the hoops are, when it hoops, it look like they are in brand new condition. And I'm gonna say just $10 on those. This is a really cute um, brooch, uh, unsigned. Lots of rhinestones, nothing missing with these three tail feathers. Enameled. <laughs> and on this, I'm going to say, let's just do $6. Now, this is an art by art uh, butterfly. Cute butterfly. It is signed right here, art. And on this one, I'm going to do ten dollars that is a great price for an art piece and not only that those colors are so retro love them so ten dollars now this piece is sterling silver it says sterling right here on the back and it's spelled out it is a horseshoe with a horse in the center and the horse in the center has um, marcasites and a pink eye a pink rhinestone for the eye. Isn't that a sweet piece? This is gonna be $14. We have a ring here. This is Mother of Pearl with um, cubic zirconia. I don't see any missing, um, wait. Nope, I don't see any missing um, rhinestones. The size of this one is a six and three fourths. Let's see, is this one signed? This one is not signed, 
But on this one, I'm going to say, let's do, that would be so cute um, if it fit me. <laughs> um, and on this one, I'm going to do just $10. These are cute. These are um, sterling silver elephants. Aren't those cute? With their trunk up. And they're kind of modernistic, I think. Um, and on these, I'm going to do just $10. We have another turtle. This is by Mod, M-O-D. It is rhinestone eyes and um, the crown on the head. And then faux pearls on the um, shell. Uh, as I said, it's by Mod gold tone and on this one i'm just gonna say six dollars now this one is um unsigned or i didn't see the sign anything signed gold tone and um these test as jade um isn't that nice with the filigree leaves and on this i'm gonna say let's do nine dollars I love this one. It is not sign, gold tone, little poodle with red um, collar and red eyes. As I said, gold tone, such a sweet little kind of 3D piece or 2D. Um, it's flat on the back and just great detail. I'm going to say let's do $8 for the dog. Here we have a mother of pearl um dove um and that's it the back here's the front and i am just going to do uh six dollars on the mother of pearl dove these earrings are sweet they are um nine to five like so and it's just leaves and on these, I'm going to say, they're sterling silver, and I'm going to say $10 on those. Here we have this faux pearl and rhinestone um, bracelet. It is a fold-over clasp, and it is so classy. Um, such a sweet look. This is, I mean, I think this is 7 inches. Let's see. Yes, 7 inches. And on this one, I'm just going to do $6. Here we have a um, shell and sterling silver pendant. There's the back. It's signed 925. And I can't read the class uh, or the logo, rather. And it is a beautiful um, mother of pearl. And on this one, I'm going to say, let's just do $10. Now, this is gorgeous. This is Listener. It is signed on the shepherd's hook. Isn't this sweet? Nothing missing. Uh, Roar Borealis um, red and pink rhinestones with red rhinestones uh, in the center um, with swirls. It has matching clip-on earrings. Aren't those gorgeous? I think this is a gorgeous set. As I said, it is a listener set. And on this, I'm going to say... Let's do um, $20 for the necklace and the earrings. That is such a holiday um, sweet uh, piece. Oh, and the, let me give you a size on it. And this is, a shepherd's hook is always easy to extend. So that's 16 inches. And uh, I already gave the price. So $20 on the earrings and the necklace. These are um, sterling silver, they're glass, they're faceted. And on these, I'm going to say, let's just do $10. Now, this is gorgeous. I love this. If this fit, does this fit? 
Let me see. I don't think it does. No, it doesn't fit me. So this is a size seven uh, sterling silver balls with a toggle clasp. And um, I just love this piece. There's your marks right here. It does say 925 silver. And on this one, I'm gonna say, let's do uh, $25. And on this, uh, I don't think there's a mark anywhere. It's just a little purse um, pendant um, with a faux alligator markings, just sweet. And on this piece, I'm going to do $10. On this piece, it is stretched, even though it looks like it is not. It has rhinestones. Let me see if there's anything missing. I don't see anything missing, so I'm just going to say $5 on this one. We have this one. Um, unsigned piece, but it is really sweet. It's like chain link, and then it has faux uh, pearls around the chains. It is super long, nice size, 36 inches, and I am just going to say a whopping $5 for those. These are pretty. These are the um, acrylic Green, I love this green. I'm trying to see if there's any name. I don't see a name. They are green and kind of a bluish color. And on these, I'm just going to say $5. These have no name either. And these are nice. Very, very um, sweet color. Um, coordinate. Uh, Sweet colors on here with the gray and the peachy look. Um, and on these, I'm going to say just $5. These are silver tone, clip-on earrings. Like so. A faux pearl. Um and faceted little acrylic beads. I'm just gonna say, let's do $3 on these. Now this, I believe, is a fashion ring. Yeah, no marks. A small little size, blue um, teardrop. It is a size five. Isn't that sweet for um, a little girl fashion ring? Um, and I'm just going to say, let's do $6 on this one. Uh, these are nice. Let's see if they're signed. I don't see a signature. They're the needles. And it's in um, a silver, a brass, and a bronze. And I'm just going to say, let's do $3 for those. This is one of the statement necklaces, but this one is so sweet with the yellow and the white. Um, this very springy, but it would be a really nice gift. It's really clean. And on this one, um, gold, um, rose gold color, and it is pretty long. This one is 24 inches with an additional three and, a, three and a half inch extension. So on this one, I am just gonna say $5. And one last bag for us to open. Let's see what we have. Um, here we have a stone. Let's see if it measures anything. some type of jasper. So on this, I'm just gonna say, let's do um, $4. Here we have um, an unsigned brooch. Well, it is signed. It has, I think it says L-E. And I'm just gonna say, let's do $3. 
Here is a pair of earrings that are signed. 925. It is two and three eighths of an inch by one and seven eighths of an inch. And they're like flat down here and rolled here. So I'm just gonna say $10 on those. Um, unsigned, but it is faux pearl um, and acrylic um, beads. It is black and white. It is 36 inches, and I am just going to say $4 on those. Here is another acrylic. This one's stretch, so I'm just going to say a dollar for the black and white stretch. Um, we have a religious uh, prayer bracelet. It has um, Mary and roses. Um, and as I said, it's just wood. And I'm just going to say $2 on those. This is a matching um, bracelet to the $1. So if you want both, it's $2 for the bracelet and the necklace. Here we have another um, brooch, and I'm just going to say a dollar for this one. That one's pretty cool, huh? Faceted. It is acrylic. We have this that has missing rhinestones, so that's just a dollar. This is gold tone with let's see, are these acrylic or glass? These are glass and um, gold tone rings with glass faceted teardrops. And this is including the um, extension is 18 inches. And I'm just gonna say, let's do $4. That is very pretty. Now this is unsigned, very retro. Um, with faux pearls, rondelles, and um, I think these are acrylic. And this is 15 inches, and I'm just gonna say a dollar for that one. Here we have um, a brass tone and glass. Let me be sure those are glass. Yes, um, cross, I'm just gonna say $5 on that one. <laughs> I just think this is so sweet. Um, no clasp that I see, super long. It has ribbons and these are old lace. These are acrylic, um, so it's acrylic and faux pearl. There is a lobster class, and these are 48 inches. And on this, I'm just gonna say $5 if anybody's interested. We have this, I don't see a name. Um, it does have a missing um, rhinestone right there. It's a little teapot brooch, but I'm just going to say $2. Here is a little um, shell. I think it's Mother of Pearl chips, actually, um, with a fast... Uh, it's on multiple braided wire, lobster class, seven inches. So I'm just gonna say a dollar. It is an owl missing the center. So I'm just gonna say a dollar. 
Here we have uh, Mother of Pearl um, shells with a barrel clasp. I'm just going to say a dollar. Here's another one with red. Um, every now and then, I'm just going to say a dollar. Here we have a rhinestone brooch. It is um, fans. Uh, so I'm just going to say, let's do $3 on that one. Here we have a bracelet with safety class. It is signed. It says P-A-J-B-B, -B, made in China. A hidden class. And they are so tiny, I can't tell if there's anything missing. But they are little stones in here. And it needs to be cleaned. So I'm just going to say $5 for this one. Here we have a, that has to be wrong, it says 14K um, Italy. I can't find my small um, stone. No, that doesn't look like gold at all. So we got a faker. Or maybe just the clasp is gold. <laughs> no, nothing. So we have a faker. It is marked 14 karat though, but it's not real. So on this, um, it is called a Figueroa chain. It is a nice chain, but it is fake. Has a lobster clasp. It is 24 inches long. And I'm just gonna say, if anybody's interested, let's do, I mean, it's a beautiful chain, so $8. We have a brooch, it is signed. I believe it says Jerry's. And that is pretty with those um, light green, um, and they're painted. And I'm gonna say, let's do $4. We have a row, no, yeah, the roses um, with a, um, they're painted with gold tone. They're signed DM at 97. So I'm going to say, let's do $5 on those. We have these earrings that are enameled uh, maple leaves and only one of them has a clasp. Let's see what it says. I can't read it. So on this, I'm going to say, let's just do $4. We've got these earrings, which are screw backs, and they're like little link chains. I'm going to say, let's just do $3 on those. We have a shell that has a chain on it. It is... 16 inches, and I'm just going to say $2. We have these earrings, which are gorgeous. A um, little bit of enamel, rhinestones. They look like gold and red um, rhinestones. And I'm going to say let's do $6 for those. We have a Manson watch um, that says unbreakable mainstream anti-magnetic Swiss made 
and it's super light and it's a wind up. Um, but it doesn't have a second hand. Oh wait, it does have a second hand, uh, but I only saw it move once. So if anybody's interested, I'm not sure if it's working, but it's got a stretch band and I'm just gonna say $5. And the last thing we have is this little um, jar, perfume jar, screw off cap, and it has some discoloration on it. So I'm just gonna say um, $6. So what'd you think? <laughs> Hope everybody's doing great. Have a wonderful weekend. Thank you for spending a little bit of your day with us and we will see you on the next one. Bye.